What's up guys, welcome to the Comar Project. And on this episode, I'm gonna show you how to break down the palette. Well, at least the way I do it. And it's a way, not the way. And how to get the nails out. The easy way. At least I think it's an easy way. Time to take some palettes apart. Why? Well, that's because we're gonna be veneering the miter station with it. So the plan is to take all these palettes apart, rip all these planks in half, maybe even in thirds, and then stain them all different colors and veneer them. Simple, right? It's never that simple, guys. Never that simple. I hate taking these things apart. It's such a pain in the butt. But! I just got something in the mail. Hopefully it'll help me. I don't even know how to use this thing. Okay. I got one, and I'm tired. This is gonna be miserable. I think I have an idea. They're not always good, but sometimes they work out. So I think I figured it out. You need this piece of this tool to rest on the cross brace, I guess, of the palette. I'm gonna show you. This piece here, on this piece. So this rests on this, and then the jaws leverage this. Right. Hard work, can you guys see? Hard work. I'm sweating. I'm sweating hard. <laughs> As you can see, nails. I got a thing for that too, because I've taken pallets apart before. Once. It took me like a month to take four of them apart. So I figured it out. I'll show you later. So excited to show you guys this thing because I didn't know last time it took me forever. This time, super quick, I hope. Yeah, like Jenga. Now, for the nails, because that's important. I have to take the nails out, right? I got that shot. I got myself one of these. It's a nail remover by Air Locker. Like Foot Locker, but with air. I probably removed a thousand nails from the pallet wall. 
all by hand with a punch and a hammer. It sucked. Then I found this. I'll show you how it works. It's super cool. All right, I got myself a tub. A bucket or anything else will do. Just fine. A compressor with a hose. All right, so check out this coolness. You plug this. You plug. Plug this bad boy in with some air. Then, take your board. Then you just take it, put it over the nail. You shoot it right into the bucket or bin. Super easy. Too easy. Let's see how it works on a little bent one. Put it in, straighten it, shoot it, and it's out. You might want to use a bucket. This thing's a little shallow. Let's see how it works when you have a bucket. Much better. They're not flying all over the place. So, use a bucket. Well, some don't go all the way out, but a little hammer action. Here, do you guys want to see how I did it before? Let me show you. Back in the day, I grabbed myself a board, hammer away. Then, God forbid, you cut the nails with a sawzall. Then you're using a punch to punch everything out. What a pain. So, I think this is a good idea. Basically what this thing is, is a reverse nail gun. So, the nail goes right into the hole. It has a hole. Right there, focus on the hole. Focus on the hole. Oh, it's got a little hole right there. Nail goes right in there. And I guess maybe you can... <gasps> oh my god. Oh my god, you can shoot it too. Let's try it. Let's try it. Alright, here we go. We're going to be aiming at the danger construction zone sign. <laughs> Something's going to go wrong. Something. Hold on. Ballistics. Yeah, totally have ballistics in the shop. You need ballistics in the shop. Let's do this. Are you guys nervous? I'm a little nervous. Okay, so I got the ammo. All right, let's load this bad boy. Oh my God. Let's do it again. Oh, I missed, I missed. That hit to the right. Yeah! Yeah, that was a bullseye. Let's go check it out. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Check this out. These right here are definite kill shots. <laughs> Got myself a marker and we're totally gonna mark them. So in the army, when you zero, you have to group three shots, right? When you come through and you mark them. And like so. So, and then you connect them, like so. I'll get better. I'm totally gonna get better at this. It's so much fun. <laughs> so there you go, my beautiful friends. This is how I take apart a pallet. It's not the way, but it's a way, and I found that this is a pretty easy way, and you can get it done very quickly. So if you're trying to figure out how to take apart a pallet, get yourself an airlock gun and one of these monstrous Tools. Maybe not in blue, but I like blue. Either way, 
it's gonna save you some time and I'm gonna put a link in the description below so you can get it for yourself. This cost me 60 bucks. The gun I believe was 50. And how long it takes me to take apart a pallet without these things, <laughs> big difference guys, big difference. Don't forget about this gun. And you know how I found out about it? I was sitting on the pooper looking through Facebook. This thing popped up right after I took apart like 20 pallets. This thing is making it cool. All right, enough messing around, but that's what I do. If you guys like this video and you found it useful, go ahead and hit that thumbs up button for me. And as always, if you have any questions, comments, put those down below and I'll get to them as soon as possible. And if you're new to the channel, consider subscribing. Thank you so much for joining me on my experience. I'll see you guys next time.